Good morning guys, so we're at my house and I got the squad. Everybody's warming up, everybody's training. Today we're doing a Dragon Ball Z inspired session. So I grew up with Goku, like I think every other Weibo kid out there. <laughs> I loved anime. I grew up with Dragon Ball Z, Naruto, some of like the most inspiring characters. To me, was definitely Goku, for sure. So I tried to do a little bit of research and I'm gonna incorporate some of the movements that I saw their training into a real life applicable training scenario. So I have some of the most amazing athletes that are all friends of mine, martial artists, actors, performers, YouTubers. We all came together and we're like, okay, let's do a Goku inspired workout. And I think we're gonna die today. So half of us are extremely sore already. Like I am so tired, but Goku's mentality, no matter what, just eat hella food, sleep a ton and go train. Let's go, Os. Okay, so. Goku was like my all-time favorite hero. Goku, Naruto, and Sasuke were like the ones that I hella looked up to and Vegeta. But today we're doing Goku and I was watching a lot of the stuff that they're doing. It's a lot of body weight exercises. Who's sore? Yeah, Goku would say stop being a bitch ass and start training. So yeah, no bitch asses today. We're gonna train really, really hard. We're gonna do three sets, three super sets of handstands first, a minute round of sparring, and then stance training just to start with. Okay? Okay, if you can't handstand, just try and do like baby versions of that. So that would just be like coming here and then coming down. Very, very simple. Yeah, if you guys can hit your handstands, find a spot. We're gonna do 10 times. You guys go at your own pace. We'll glove up, minute sparring, stance training, nonstop three times. Oh. Ooh, let's go. <laughs> I've never heard Goku say bitch before. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> Not once. Kso! How are you feeling, Peter? Feeling good, Dang, man. You got the Dragon Ball Z shirt. Right. Whoa. Dang. You one. know, just needed some water, but <laughs> no water. No water to end the training. All right, everybody partner up quick. Let's go. I just want to come hang out with friends, catch up with everybody. And they're like, no, we're gonna train like Dragon Ball. One minute. All right. Ooh, ooh, that's how you get the leg. That's it, baby. That's it. Ooh. See, what they don't teach you is that the Kamehameha is actually from big ass quads. And your legs should be shaking. <laughs> Stop being your chest, go deeper. You gotta go wider, man. Wider? Yeah. And have your, have your toes pointing forward. Like what? Yeah, there oh. you go. Did you ever, when you were younger, like in the shower and tried to like make an energy ball? Yeah. I would always be super sane. I'll just go to my friends. <laughs> <laughs> you would do that? Yeah. Oh, you did you ever do that? You ever try to like do it when you're by yourself? Just be like, let me see if I can power up real quick. Oh, just yeah, to bro. check. <laughs> just yeah. to check. Just to make sure. Like, <laughs> but it's a real thing. It works. You're about to work out. <laughs> <laughs> you just go in. <laughs> you just need some love. You just need some love, oh, baby. Gosh, meditation. All right, good vibes again. We're good. I can feel his aura from across. The yard. <laughs> it's so heavy. <laughs> <laughs> Rocks come up slowly like a Dragon Ball. <laughs> okay, super sets again. Same exact setup. Three rounds non stop. First exercise, if you can, one handed push ups. We're gonna do five on both sides, right? And then left. From there, we're gonna do one line on the grass, and you're gonna either beginner version is cartwheels, one handed cartwheels, or aerials and we'll do a line of that. So we'll make one line, everybody just reps it out, and then we'll come back out here, okay? But I want you guys to try and hit about three in a row, if you can. Then after that, gloves back up. Something that's like famous in Dragon Ball Z is their ridiculous speed, and like how fast they just go, 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 go. We're gonna do 100 punches in a row with shields. Knock out your punches as hard as you can, as fast as you can. All right, knock them out, let's go. Goku! I am Goku! I picked aerials just because 
in Dragon Ball Z, they do like inhuman movements. So this is the closest that we can kind of get to inhuman. Aerials, us. Alright, here's the uh, camera's perspective. Did everybody go? Yo, Ted, go! My cameraman must be able to hit tricks. It's important to learn how to redline. I'm exhausted. This is hard. This is hella hard. But when you're doing movement specific drills and when you're extremely tired, this is the time to test if you can actually do them clean. Okay, just one, just one. Okay, go. Oh, no, okay, he missed, but it still hurt. <laughs> I just got word. Brawly's coming to Earth. Oh, no. So I got Gohan and Trunks. Let's unlock Super Saiyan together. Yes! All right! Okay. What? <laughs> Fine! <laughs> ah! Us, 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 I, yeah. didn't, I didn't love it. Yeah. Thank you guys. Yeah. I'm properly tenderized. Yeah. Woo, I feel like a, Oh look, it's red. See? Oh snap. Then, <laughs> you look sunburned. He started hitting up higher, so I started like blocking up here. It's like he's not hitting your abs, he's hitting your like sternum, uh, yeah. Sternum, yeah. So I tried to get on my toes and I tried to guard my sternum. And he's like, no. Nothing works. <laughs> okay, so for active rest, we're gonna do a wing chung drill. So a lot of Dragon Ball Z obviously is like hella energy blast. So I'm like, how the hell do we like incorporate that into a martial arts workout? I think it would be great to add that with sensitivity drills. So we're gonna do a drill called Dan Chi Sao. It's one hand sticky hand drill. You guys, the stance doesn't really matter, but this is like more wing chung stance. Left hand's gonna be chambered or his right hand, yeah. So this is called a Fuk Sao. It's resting position here. Ted's gonna go for a palm strike. Go ahead, slow. I'm gonna come down and block. Then I go for the punch, he's gonna bong sao. Then we reset here, go ahead, slow. So we're gonna do this drill for three minutes. But the idea is not to pull or punch hard, it's to stay connected. So he's gonna go for the palm strike and I come and do a down block here. Here, then we're gonna go for our punch and he's gonna block with what we call a bong sao. The finger should always be pointed forward and we use the forearm. Okay, then we reset. Ted's in charge of resetting so he flips the hand and I come back down into the, the reset. All right, let's do it. I'll, I'll walk around and help everybody, but three minutes, timer's on. All right guys, so you guys can do that as the active rest at the very end, three to five minutes of that chi sao drill or any kind of sensitivity drill that you guys have. Stretch afterwards. Did you guys have fun? Yes yeah. sir! That's it? That was really hard. Yeah, that's it. That was almost an hour. Oh damn. Yeah. <laughs> that was really hard. Round two, Thanks. All right, it's gonna get even crazier when I do a Naruto one or My Hero oh. Academia. Uh, -uh. uh All right guys, thank you guys. Subscribe to the channel, comment below us. Oh,